but also for the other player, can I avoid getting grabbed and get zero to death? And Lucario is not a character that you want to get zero to death on. No, no, you want to be able to live at those high percents, use your really strong recovery, and your aura like you and said, rage. Your aura rage stacking on top of each other to make you a ruthless killing it machine. Is, <laughs> it's a, it, it is such a gross combo. Like killing with back airs, you know, at you know fifty from yeah, the middle of the stage. No. Is it was it Sue? Or uh, I'm sorry, I I think Sue is the Japanese the Lucario. Japanese Lucario player. Yeah, I think that sounds right in my head. I remember watching that player at Frostbite, and I was just like, this is actually insane how much damage this character could do but like it's also like if you play it yourself it's also like kind of hard because he's he's kind of weird like his back air comes out kind of slow and it's a bit of a he's a bit of an odd character so and but it, it's like having x-factor like you pop your x-factor at like 150 it's like all right i'm a character now just hit the wong factor real quick get in there all right is it chic is that their tag or is that just their let's see if they finally open it up yeah it's it's chic oh it's elh chic yeah, I've actually played. Uh, is it Chic or Chick? Is yeah. it Chick? Okay. Chick, yeah. Well, I'm sorry that I'm trying to be <laughs> modern. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Trying to go for that jump call out early. I believe Chick played uh, Luigi in Smash 4 as well, actually. So, sticking with his main across games. That's uh, always really fun to see. Yeah, no. Character loyalty can be strong. Tries to find the pivot grab there. So. That said, this is a very different Luigi from Oh, here's oh no, boy. it's not going to start. He's actually just going to go for the upper chains. Finds a forward or two yeah. to boot off. Kind of going for the classic style, you know, before all that was found, I suppose. Yeah. And in the classic style. <laughs> <laughs> the, the classic Luigi player as opposed to the modern ones. Yeah. Oh, oh wow. Almost finding him. Okay. That recovery is better now. It is still very punishable if you just do it to the stage. Yeah. It's, it's no longer six years of landing lag, but... It, It'll still take some time. Yeah. All right. These backers are going to start getting more and more dangerous. We've already seen. And you see big, that that aura the big sphere. Blue, the big blue aura coming in. Yeah, he's looking. That's actually going to wow. kill. Wow. At 60. At 60. You goofed once, and you got got. Yeah. That, that's, that's what happens. And now his goal is just to rack up as much percent as he can before he loses this aura and rage and gets to his next stock. Yeah. Oh wow, the that down to two frame. Yeah, down to catching the two I frame. I mean, Lucario's recovery is absolutely incredible, so that's. Woo! Yeah. Yeah, no. The L losing the, the second jump off the two frame wasn't, isn't as big a deal for Lucario as it would for, be for a lot of characters. But. Okay. Oh boy. Oh no. no. Not oh, quite no. finding the spike hitbox of that. That's what you need to be able to start off, is you need the spike. He's not going to be able to find it there, but he's going to go ahead and just get some damage yeah, on. Rack on a little bit of that percent, get him towards. I mean, both of them towards kill percent, really. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's it, it is scary because it's like it's it's like any revenge meter is generally agreed upon to be kind of rough mechanic. Yeah, you know. So like in Ultra Street Fighter Four, you had you know the the ultra meter, which you would get for dealing damage, but also for taking it. Yeah. And so it was very hotly contested as well. Oh my goodness! Oh. Very hotly contested as whether that was good. <laughs> He's doing so much damage. And yeah. Any any single touch basically. Uh oh. Was that a taunt? That was a little bit. Of, that was a little little, little scuff of the dust. Ooh. Oh, he really likes that counter. He does, but it's goes. costing him. Yeah, especially like it. Oh no! Oh man! Every when Luigi gets that grab, it's always terrifying. Searching. Oh, oh my goodness! No. Okay, that still holds true across all games. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the uh, except for 64, they don't have spot dodge. <laughs> Can you imagine? Oh my gosh! I, I play a fair amount of 64, but I like, play actually a fair amount myself. Actually, it's it's just I, not getting certain moves. It's just like, yeah, I don't like it. But <laughs> very very solid stuff there from Chick. I'm still really having a hard time not saying, you know. But I understand why you'd want to avoid the confusion with there being a character named after him. Uh, all right, what are we thinking for the counter? I mean, you could go for the bait. That makes people think you're a Sheik exactly. man. Exactly. Then, then you they play right into your hands. Yeah, bust out the Luigi. Well, it's not really playing into your hands anymore. Now it's into your Poltergust 5000. You, you thought I couldn't kill. <laughs> <laughs> you thought. <laughs> All right. Right back into it. Uh, so we're going to Battlefield here, it looks like. Okay. I think that actually makes a lot of sense for Lucario here. Just give him a little more room. That up B has so much range. He can kind of go to that top platform and kind of run away a little better if he has to. Just kind of get back down to the ground. These parries coming out pretty nicely here from Leslie, though. That is one of the, the odder things about up tilt to me is that it doesn't quite hit behind Luigi like it does right. in some other games. Uh, okay. No, he's fine. <laughs> that super jump punch got an appropriate compensation. Uh,
because you lose out on the Cyclone Mash. Right. Which is a real bummer, but it does make sense um, in some ways. Yeah. I, although it was really funny to see, like, Luigi's brag about how much faster they could mash. And yeah. Mapping both A and B or something to... Uh, most of the strat you would see would be full D-pad to be... Oh, right, yeah. yeah. Super funny. Oh. Yep, yep. Super laggy on that, but getting enough punish out forward smash of his own. And at zero, none of that. A little bit of aura from being behind in stocks, but... Yeah, it feels like uh, Chick's combo tree here is just a little bit... Like, he has the old school stuff, but if he really wants to up his game, he needs to start getting that, that new age, that woo in there. You know? mm -hmm. I mean, a lot of the old stuff still works. It's, oh, it's yeah. just no longer optimal is kind of the way it boils down. And, you know, you can do well with, you know, suboptimal stuff as long as you feel confident and can execute it every time. But that F smash is going to take that stock pretty easily. Pretty grotesque. <laughs> <laughs> so Every time I, I look at Lucario and, like, the percent at which Lucario is killing, I just <laughs> die a little inside. It's quite amazing <laughs> how powerful this character can be. And with, he, with he's one of the scariest players. Like, every, anytime you play one in, in bracket, it doesn't matter... If you're playing you know, round one pools or you know later in the bracket, it's just like I cannot take damage once I do damage to this yeah, character. I've, I've got to be able to finish the stock off as quickly as possible. And like 133, you know, it's really only two touches from Lucario should end up killing Luigi, and that back throw is not going to end the stock. Okay, finds the way back down. I, I feel like with the movement buffs, particularly with like every character back throw, not quite. With the movement buffs, Lucario gets a lot uh, more of an ability to kind of work around things. Oh. That's spooky stuff here. Oh, wow. I can't believe that counter. Like, Just that must have been like the first act or frame where that wouldn't have actually counted. Yeah, that was insane. So nice little start off. Now we it. got a full stock lead, essentially, for Chick, which uh, kind of works out pretty well, though now we're getting that rage again. That snagged in out of the air? Oh, my goodness. A tether grab? Oh, okay. no. Call him out on it. Let him know what's going on. He's up, beast. Double ding. Yeah, ended both games on the same move, basically. Just like, I mean, again, Lucario's up B is so, la you know, it's better than it was. Oh, yeah. It's like they have the frames, and you can still run up and up B anytime you want to, almost. Oh, God. But just to be able to just say, all right, I know you're going to come straight down. You're going to bounce, and I'm going to take you out. Yeah. Sounds good to me. Sounds good to you. And when, when you got that kind of a punish, you know, when you got rest, when you've got, you know, Lucario's up B, are there any other moves even, like, on that level as far as just, like, Every time you're I hear dead? that noise, I'm just like... All right, quick.